One last video. One last video. Any day now. The good guys. This music is so awesome. Diddy sucks. Win Dixie is so much better than Diddy. Don't even know. Don't even know. Then Rambi, of course. It's pretty cool. Squawks is pretty cool too. I like Squawks, alright? I like Squawks. On Garde, or however you pronounce it. It's not seen too often because there aren't even that many water levels. Squitter is by far my favorite. Go Squitter, you rock. Radley is probably my least favorite. But you don't see him that much either. You, hell, you don't see many of them at all. Funky, who's also sucks. I don't like him. Wrinkly's cool though. She dies and is like in 64 as a ghost or something like that. And then we have the baddies. We have Captain K. Rule instead of King K. Rule. Who sucks in this game. King Zing Sting. Who is kind of annoying, but otherwise alright. We got Crow, who we fought twice. He's alright. And then we got Cleaver, he's cool. He's an interesting boss. It's like a weird idea for a boss. Clubba! Who I gave a weird Scottish accent. Clumps! Normal Kremlins. Bum 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 bum. Kaboings, who are kind of cool, I guess. I don't know. Crunches! They're annoying. I don't like them. Clampons. They're weird. Ooh. Clingers. I like how they all start with K. Clobber. That's what they're called. Clobbers. Guys in the barrel. Click clacks are weird. Little beetle guys. And then we got the weaker. Neek. I've been calling them Meeks, like M, Meek, but they're called Meeks, damn it. And then Zingers, who are, <laughs> crap, they need to die in a fire. Flitters are less evil forms. Neckies are alright. Mmm, rich crackers. Cannons are cool, I guess. They're always naked, which is weird, and they look like they have boobs. Crooks are awesome and they're my favorite. I just spit all over the place. Ooh, spinies are annoying too. Croc heads are cool. Don't see them that much and it looks cool going across there and going across the ground. Flotsam. And, oh, I was hoping it'd be Jetsam or something like that. Lockjaw. Shuri, I don't know why it's called that. Probably something in Japanese. And popped up. And that is it. So much for the awesome music, right? Now we got the kind of meh credits music. And kind of meh credits. Don't even give their first names. Just give their last names. Why not? The original game. Why not? Why not credit the people who made Donkey Kong Land, even though they had nothing to do with this game? Normally, I guess. I don't know. And presented by Nintendo, produced by Rare. Yeah, yeah. Rare, come back to Nintendo, you bastards. As if you'll ever actually watch this. Thank you for watching. Let's play Donkey Kong Land 2. Now we can go around. And yeah. We got one, two, three, four, five, six worlds basically. Well, technically seven. Shiver me timbers, where's me loot? Y'all taste me club if you don't get some more. So that again is David Jones locker for you. Oh, you must be joking. Alright. Yes, Donkey Kong Land 2. All in all, it's a pretty fun game. Donkey Kong Country 2 may actually be better. I don't know, because I haven't played it. Ever. I don't think I've ever played it, actually. Maybe once. 
Like I said, I don't know. So it's actually probably better since it's on the Super Nintendo instead of the Game Boy. But this is a good rendition of Donkey Kong Country. I may eventually play Donkey Kong Country 1 and 2 or Donkey Kong Land 1. Probably never going to play Donkey Kong Country 3 or Land 3. So don't expect those to ever exist. Thank you for watching again. I'll see you guys next time.